War always carries a cost, and my war on crime is no different. The truth is, no matter how hard I fight, I can't save everyone. In order to maintain my cover with the Pact, I had to sacrifice Selena. I just hope I can explain myself to her one day. But first, I have to stop Harley Quinn and her crew from stealing a deadly virus. With it, they could carry out mass murder in Gotham on a scale the city has never seen. Just gotta take out one itty bitty god. Then we can get the rest of the gang inside. Time to paint this place red, Brucey boy. No, let me handle this. <clears throat> can I help you? We're here for a massage. Couples massage? Nothing too vigorous. We need to save our energy for, uh, other activities. Sorry, looks like we're all booked up. You'll need to return some other time. Maybe call ahead first. Don't make this harder than it has to be. Step away, or I make life very difficult for you. You're the one who needs to leave. Looks like we're gonna have to teach him a lesson. Let me call my manager. He's packing! <sighs> hey! Nicely done. For a second there, I thought you'd really gone chicken. We're in. You losers gonna join the party or what? Did you run into trouble? <laughs> Nothing we couldn't handle. Be ready. More will come. He's always so serious. Be on the lookout for security measures. We can disable them from here. Nicely done, Brucey. Come on, the clock is ticking. Jeez. Lots of doors. Hey, should we uh, just start opening them? Secret lab? Hey! <laughs> Not that one. Hey, hey, you shouldn't be here. <laughs> whoa, 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 hold up. I think this is it. Then that's where we want to go. What is this? Watch closely. Oh, good! I could use a little color. The dear departed Riddler's gonna help us out. Very clever. Come on, we're taking a ride. Just so we're all clear, this is a smash and grab operation. We smash the lab, grab the virus, and then we're gone. A virus? Sounds dangerous and unpredictable. If used properly, it should allow me to cure my Nora. And I will be able to perfect the power of my venom. The virus can do all that? <laughs> this is so exciting. The moment we've all been waiting for. Ooh, we gotta get this one for the history books. <sighs> Make sure you get my good side. Okay, everybody. Say cheese. Come on. 
roofs. You're not even in it. Well, that's no good. Take two. <laughs> Huddle up. <gasps> hey, mister. Which way to all your most dangerous toys? <laughs> Someone's being a bad boy. Don't. Don't give her a reason. So boring. Chop, chop, boys. It's the last mile. Waller, I'm in. Good. We're on our way. Do not let the pack get their hands on that virus, Bruce. I've got it under control. Talking to yourself, huh? John. It's, it's okay, Bruce. I talk to myself all the time. To be honest, my voices haven't been letting up lately either. I, I keep thinking this virus was the thing holding us all together. It's what made us stick. I, I, I don't know, call me paranoid, but I'm worried once it's gone, Harley's just gonna just disappear. I just don't think I could take that kind of rejection. You know, when you invest so much into something. John, just because Harley might get what she's after, it doesn't mean she'll toss you to the curb. She cares about you. Maybe. But I'm not so sure. I know it may seem like a fairy tale, but my relationship with Harley isn't as rock solid as the friendship you and I have, Bruce. Come on. Let's just get this over with. All right, John, plug in the drive. According to Riddler's plan, we just gotta upload this little program into their system. Uh, weird. I, I don't think it's going to work, Harley. Seriously, Puds? All I asked you to do was be the tech guy. Congratulations, you're hired. Now let's get this show on the road. Change oh. Was that the expected result? Hang on, would ya? Now that's what Mama wanted to see. Hang on to that, Brucey. I can't afford any more mishaps. All right, let's get moving. The lab is this way. The enemy, dead ahead. <laughs> 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 if these fools want to fight, I am more than happy to oblige. Heads up, fellas! You would be wise to get out of our way. <laughs> Careful, Wayne. Your aversion to killing is testing my patience. Damn it. We don't have time for you to be incapacitated. Open, Bruce.
initiated emergency protocol. We'll be incinerated. I would advise you all to get down on the floor. Should have brought my scarf. Bruce, get the door. these terminals before I can destroy the virus. Here. 
Yes! I've done it. I did it, Nora. Tiffany and tell her to get to the manor. Harley's escaped with the virus. Right away. Get me a proper lockdown crew in here, Stat. I want bio scans on Freeze. Do not let him out of that airlock. Move it, people! Good work here, Bruce. Well, you managed to stay close to them until the end, I'll give you that. But with Doe still loose in Gotham, and the Lotus virus in the hands of a psychopath, I'm not sure good is the word I'd use to describe what happened here. Oh, I could think of some more colorful words to describe this situation. Catwoman isn't an issue, and John is harmless on his own. We need to focus on Harley. She has the Lotus sample. As much as I hate to admit it, you have a point. Sanctus, right under our noses all this time. Oh, chemical weapons, human experimentation. Sanctus was, is, the darkest part of the Agency's history. Oh, this place is just... evil. And that's why we're shutting it down once and for all. We can take some of this equipment and put it to good use. <sighs> this facility needs to be raised to the ground. I don't want so much as a trace of it left in my city. Why don't you let me worry about that, Wayne? Bruce, you need to get after Quinn and quick. She's out there with the virus, and that's a threat to Gotham we simply can't allow. Freeze must have an idea about where she'd go in these circumstances. <laughs> Don't waste your time with that maniac. He'd say anything to throw us off track. But he's our best lead. Well, I disagree. Freeze is nothing more than a science experiment gone awry. You best keep your focus on Harley and the virus before anyone else gets hurt. She just completely shut me down. She's normally so open to all possible leads. This is so unlike her. Waller was out of line. She should know to trust your instincts. Usually she does. Listen, Director Waller may think it's a waste of time, but I say leave no stone unturned. I'll see what I can find out. Hey, Will. Give me a hand with this, will you? I think there may be something we can salvage back here. Possibly have been money. I failed to see what you have to gain. 
What matters is that you get help. Let me do that. Your compassion is a hollow act. Don't insult my intelligence with your baseless offers. From where I'm standing, it's Harley who betrayed you. She abandoned you, Victor. All of you. I need your help to find her. If you want me to tell you what I know about Harley, I'm going to need something from you in exchange. The Agency intends to keep me prisoner with this virus living inside me. Given the chance, I could beat this just like Riddler. He became stronger for it. You're telling me that when Riddler worked here, he became infected with the Lotus virus? If he could survive it, I believe I can too. That dial, there, they've keyed it into the temperature regulators in the airlock. All I need from you is to turn that dial. Let my body do the rest. <laughs> If you want to know where Harley is, you'll keep me from being Waller's test subject. Lower the temperature in the airlock. I know that I can fight this. Take it up with Waller. This isn't part of my job description. She doesn't understand what the virus is capable of. Not like I do. It doesn't have to be this. Riddler's blood can turn the virus into something that can heal. That's why we stole his body. Why your friends in the Agency had it on ice. My Nora will perish if I don't use Lotus to save her. Bane merely hoped to cure himself of his addiction. Harley already has the virus. <laughs> Now, she needs a blood sample from Riddler's body. With it, she will have what she needs to create the serum. She will destroy anything that gets in her way. She'll go for the body first. That's how you will find her. I already have samples of the blood. Look for a temperature-controlled container. Now... You have what you came for. Please, reconsider. I need to get to the subway right away. If Harley's trying to make this serum, she'll go straight for Riddler's blood. I'm coming with you. The secondary properties of this virus. The serum they want to make from it. I've got a feeling Director Waller didn't want us to hear that. Which would explain why she steered you away from Freeze. What is she up to, I wonder? Waller always operates on some hidden agenda. Surprised that's news to you. I guess it's not. News, that is. I guess I just have blinders on when it comes to people I look up to. But don't worry about that now. If we hurry, we can intercept Harley at the lair. You probably shouldn't suit up for this. The less attention we draw to ourselves, the better. Suit up? Damn it. You don't know that I told Waller you were Batman, do you? Really? Are we... Are we all good? It's just... We never talked about it. I'd like to clear the air. Well, it's your job to figure people out. I can't hold it against you. Whew. I'm glad you see it that way.
suppose I should have seen this coming. She's become more and more erratic since she came to Gotham. I hardly know what she's going to do next. Harley? No. Director Waller. I'm not used to her keeping me out of the loop. Ah! Damn! Ow! Ah, the hell is wrong with this thing? <sighs> Damn it, sorry. I, I, I've got a passive anti-surveillance system running. It must have triggered What did your... you say, Bruce? Looked like you were speaking, but can't hear so well without these. I was saying the car as a passive security system. It triggered feedback in, in your hearing aids. Crappy agency technology. Not your fault. Look, it's fine. I'd just rather not talk about it. I have to admit, a part of me was sort of hoping we'd be taking the Batmobile. Not that this car isn't great, but, you know, it's no Batmobile. Oh, we are taking it. I don't follow. I push a button, the armor plates flip, and voila, Batmobile. That's incredible, if you're not just pulling my leg. Yeah, Lucius Fox was a genius. You've put a lot of time and energy into this crusade. I prefer to think of it as a mission. Do you ever question it? Not the mission. I mean, the methods. The clandestine nature of what you do. The fear tactics. The occasional brutality. No judgment. No. Never. Damn. I wish I had that kind of competence. I'm having a bit of an existential crisis. Existential crisis? <sighs> yeah. It's Waller. Why wouldn't she want us to know what Freeze told you? Things have gotten gray recently. Too gray. I don't know if I'm on the right side anymore. Maybe I shouldn't have brought this up. So what are you saying? I wish I knew exactly. I was hoping talking to you would give me some clarity. Hey, you sure you're okay to do this? Absolutely. You know, I looked through Gordon's case files about Harley. Her father suffered from mental illness that eventually drove him to suicide. An illness with a strong hereditary link. It's very possible she wants the serum to prevent the same thing happening to her. If she fails, she's got one deadly plan B. <laughs> Don't sound so worried, Batman. I'm here to help. We're almost there. Riddler's blood. She'll be incredibly dangerous. Hey, you don't need to tell me. Then we're on the same page. <sighs> I knew she'd be able to do it. Who? And do what? Catwoman. They threw her in this murder box before we left. Think she's still around? No. She's a runner. I doubt we'll be hearing from her anytime soon. Harley. She must be gone already. Do you think that means she already has the vials? I don't know, but it's worth a look. Maybe she got scared off before she could find them. Blood, but... Was this here before? Dried. Must be from when Harley shot Bane's men. Damn it. What is it? They're gone. The vials are gone. So... Keep looking.
C4, plastic explosive. Only a little, though. Must be remnants from something bigger. I don't remember Bane making bombs, and it doesn't match Freeze's M.O. Wonder if whoever took the vials also made a bomb. C4 certainly doesn't sound like the agency. Who then? Harley? John? Even money on both. Hey, Avesta, does this look familiar? We call it a liminal device, a not quite as powerful phalanx key. Some agency field ops are issued one, and if they left it, they must have been rushed. An agency team has been here. C4 doesn't seem like agency issue. No, but with Waller these days, who knows? Huh. On the side here, someone's damaged this. Oh. oh, God. I thought this thing was supposed to preserve him. Obviously, it failed. Wait. Decomposition is actually accelerated. They purposefully disabled the capsule. If that's the case, then they were trying to destroy the body. It's textbook asset denial, but it's some sloppy work. They were moving fast. Too fast. If Harley decides to release the virus, that sample may be the most valuable weapon we have. Alfred, I did a bioscan of Riddler's corpse. I'm sending the data to you. The body is breaking down, so... Do your best with it. Received, Bruce. It's... Oh, my. This may take a bit of time. So, Waller takes the blood and has Riddler's body destroyed. That would make her the only player who could create a viable Project Lotus sample. Having all the pieces to the puzzle. Oh, my God. Bruce. The Pact all had problems. Medical problems they needed solving. And if Waller's the solution, she can make them work for her. She's not above using leverage to get people under her thumb. I mean, look what she did with my identity. Harley. The virus! Where is she, John? Where's Harley? I don't think we've been formally introduced. Doe. John Doe. <laughs> I asked you a question, John. I heard you, Bruce. I do understand English. <sighs> she was here. Wait, she was here? Yeah. Where is she now, John? This is important. You got some real nerve. You know that? Buddy! Remember the cafe? Just manipulate her, John. And then you told me she'd stay with me. You promised? And for what? She flew the coop! 
And I, I have nothing. You steered me wrong. At every turn, every bad piece of advice, everything blew up in my face. Would you stop feeling sorry for yourself? Well, gosh, thanks. We so much better. There's no point. It's over. The pact. The dream. Us. Not yet, it's not. She's still out there, with a deadly virus in a city full of innocent people. Call me when you got something I care about. It always surprises me how heavy guns are. John, don't be stupid. I will break your hand to get that gun. Oh, Bruce, you're always so serious. <laughs> I was joking. Well, it's been real. What are you doing, John? Leaving. There's nothing left for me here. A lot of bad memories. And a weird smell. John, I understand you want to run. I've run before. But problems, they just come with you. No matter how far you go. Nope. Pretty sure I can get away from that smell. Damn it, John. Listen to me. I need to find Harley. I don't want to do this anymore. Not for you. Not for her. Certainly not for Gotham. <laughs> so, that's a wake-up call. Fine. The agency was here. They took the blood while I was up here. In my dark place. Then Harley showed up, the blood was gone, Riddler's body ruined. She was furious. That's how I got this. So, thanks for the slap on top of that. And where do you think Miss Quinn is now? We'd like to find her sooner rather than later. I don't want to find her. My heart can't take another kicking. I don't ever see her again. She ruined me. I, I can't. I'm too fragile right now. And you're not gonna let me off that easy. I just can't say no to you, Bruce. You gotta keep an eye on this guy. That Wayne Charm gets him every time. You sure know how to spin things. All the right ways to uh, twist my arm. It's going to take me a few hours to find her. I have to check a few places, do some things. Okay, we'll come with you. <laughs> no, you won't. There will be plenty of time for John and Bruce later. This is... I need to do this alone. I'll call you when I find something. Wait, hold on. We really like your help, John. Are you sure you won't reconsider us coming with you? We're coming with you. You're being a real jerk, Bruce. When you first walked through that door, I honestly thought you came here to check on me. John, stop. Bruce. Oh, relax. Bye. No. Oh. I'm going to track down those vials in the agency's cold storage. Be careful. Thanks. Alfred, how's the bioscan analysis going? Nearly complete. I should have it ready for you when you arrive. I'm on my way. Back. I'm taking over at the computer.
Please don't. Help. Help can you hear me? Alfred? Oh, uh, 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 what's, what's the matter? Uh, Thomas, uh, let's, let's chat. Now's the time. It won't be long. No, Al, it's me. It's Bruce. Yes, what would Master Bruce think about what you've done? I don't know, he, he, he and the, the, the Cobblepot boy are playmates. Please, please wake up. Bruce, I, where, where, where am I? Easy, easy, you're in the cave. Take your time, think back, and tell me exactly what happened. Ah, oh, no, it was... It was nothing. I was... I was working and I felt... I felt dizzy for a moment. Uh, I, I must have been more exhausted than I realized. Uh, and, well, basically that's all there is to it. First it's your hand shaking and now you're... You're passing out. We, we can't keep ignoring this. You need to be looked at before it gets worse. Uh, well, Ted... Hey, 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 hey. Be careful. Oh. Oh. Thank you, Bruce. I'll just catch my breath. Just give me a moment, please. It's all nonsense. What is? Freeze's magic cure-all. It doesn't work as intended. Take a look. Lotus. Megavirus. Only one known survivor. Riddler. Freeze thinks his blood is now a key to unlocking Lotus's true potential. The bioscan of Riddler's body. I used the analysis you sent me to simulate its interaction with the virus. And the bat computer promptly found holes in Freeze's calculations. It appears that Lotus can be synthesized into a restorative agent for the human body. A remarkable one. Well, Freeze got that part right, but... But as soon as Lotus repairs any physical problems, it causes irreparable damage to the subject's brain chemistry. It drives you insane. It's what Riddler meant when he said, I wasn't always like this. All of these people, all of them trying to kill each other, for something that will make them as deranged as he was in the end. We all should know by now that miracles come with a cost. Lotus is nothing more than a poison. Harley's already insane, Alfred. I doubt she's worried about taking it up a notch. Yes, you're probably right. Although if she wants the serum to avoid what happened to her father, well, <laughs> it's certainly ironic. Run the simulation again. Then forward the readings to Special Agent Imana Vesta. Ah, I already ran it several times myself. I... I wanted to, to be thorough. Silly notion, I know. My problems are purely psychological. My real cure is a very long vacation. Somewhere far away from Gotham. A place where the sun actually comes to visit. Maybe if you'd listen to me and start seeing your therapist. Uh, yes, yes, I know. It's just, the more I talk about my kidnapping last year and my rescue by Batman, the harder it is keeping certain details a secret. You should understand that. Avesta. I read your report. The serum makes the whole thing beyond dangerous. Did you find out where Waller's keeping Riddler's blood? Yeah. She's got the area on lockdown, but I think I can get myself in. And then, I'm taking these things off the table. Permanently. Just... hold on. Let me find a way to help. You've got to be around in case John finds Harley. And this needs to be done quickly. I won't let Waller turn the Agency back into something like Sanctus, Bruce. The vials have to go. Good luck. Let's get you somewhere more comfortable. Oh, Bruce. Uh, Tiffany's up there. She's probably wondering where I hurried off to. Uh, 
I'm sorry, Albert. We can't risk you falling again. Very well. Oh, we, we mustn't keep Tiffany worrying any longer. She's done quite enough of that the past few days. Ready? I'm afraid that's all we do. Worry the ones closest to us. Okay, yes, thank you. The doctor is on her way. How are you feeling? Well, better. A little more rest and some tea, and I'll be as good as new. Make that a lot more rest, Alfred. You're hurt. The only thing hurt is my pride. Which, sadly, even the doctor won't be able to fix. You can put up a strong front, but I'm not leaving your side until the doctor arrives. Got it? Understood. Be straight with me. How worried should I be? You don't need to sugarcoat it. I just need facts. I'll let Alfred tell you himself. I told you, I'm fine. Yeah, I'm sorry, it's just... There's a lot more to worry about right now than me. So... Bruce, um, after our little talk at your office, I had an idea. There's something I want to show you. So, I've been working on this in my spare time. I know you said I needed to train, but... I started thinking about a tactical suit, in case I'm ever needed in the field. Para-Aramid synthetic lining. Photo-adaptive suit coloring. Full-spectrum, full-surround heads-up display. I should be able to get the mesh fabricated in no time. I'm getting ahead of myself. The last thing you want is me out there on the rooftops with you. This wasn't all just about me. You've been going up against some heavy opposition, Bruce. More than usual. Alfred told me how Bane nearly killed you. So I designed you this. That's a gun. Let me read you the specs. That man doesn't use guns, Tiffany. You mean, at all? I guess I've never seen you use one. I don't use a gun, because Batman doesn't kill. Okay, I get it. Still, criminals are always trying to kill Batman. Are you telling me you've never once considered a gun? Just to even the odds? Of course I think about it sometimes. It'd be the easiest thing in the world. But easy doesn't make it right. Bingo. Listen, I should have thought it through more. I just got so caught up in the design, I didn't... I have a lot left to learn. No, don't be so hard on yourself. to go. We'll be waiting right here. John?
broken. Dr. Quinzel, this is Harley's. Making this easy on me, you know? What am I gonna say to Bruce? It, 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 it wasn't me. I, I, I mean, it, it was me, but it, it was self-defense. I, I know it needs work! Stop judging me! You agent! You should never have come here! It's about boundaries, you know? This, this place, it was special to me and Harley. She came here to hide from people like you. And you rudely show up uninvited? You, you, you were uninvited, weren't you? But how do I know? Bruce didn't send you after me. He's so buddy-buddy with the agency. No! Bruce wouldn't do that. It was like this when I showed up. No, no, no. Think, 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 John! Think! Bruce? I'm so glad you're here. Please, it just... It, it's, it's not what it looks like. I, I can't explain. Just try and reserve judgment. What have you done, John? No, no, please! It's, it's, just hear me out. What happened? Is Harley here? She left just as I got here. The agents, they came looking for her. They're not supposed to just start shooting, Bruce. They're supposed to say, hands up! I've seen it on the TV. They just attacked you. I tried to talk sense into them, but they Listen, they, they just wanted blood. Something took hold of me. Something dark and vicious and desperate for survival. I grabbed the nearest thing and started swinging. <laughs> you think this is funny? I'm, so, I'm sorry. I, I always laugh when I'm nervous. I 
decorated, didn't I? <laughs> I wonder what Harley would think of the new color scheme. <laughs> <clears throat> You said you hit them with something. I think so. I, I just grabbed whatever came to hand. This woman has a gunshot wound. Oh, really? In the back. Oh, yeah, it's, uh, it's, it's coming back to me now. She was going for her partner's gun, and I, I just, I just went on autopilot. I didn't stop until I was safe. I've just been sitting here in the dark until you came in you can be straight with me john why wouldn't i be telling you the truth if i hadn't fought them off i'd be the one lying in a pool of blood you 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 believe me don't you because if we don't have trust what we really have john there's more to this story than you're letting on what the heck you're supposed to be on my side! I guess I'm an idiot for expecting that, aren't I? What do you mean? Whatever this is between us, it's off balance. The goodwill only flows one way, and it isn't towards me. You've made that very clear by now. Known things were wrong the moment you put that tracker on me. You've been using me from the start. At least have the decency to admit it. The least you can do is come clean about that. I'm not stupid, Bruce. Please, please, don't feed me any more lies. Okay. Maybe I have been using you. I'm sorry, John, but there's more at stake here than your feelings. It's like Dr. Leland always said. Never demean another person's emotions! <laughs> John? <laughs> I know. You can fight better than that. What do you need your bat suit to really get you in the mood? What? You forget I know you, Bruce. The real you. Always hiding behind some kind of mask. Playboy, businessman, criminal. Bat. Can't fool a friend. Someone who really takes the time to look. John, John, that's ridiculous. I'm the furthest thing from Batman there is. No, oh, you don't have to keep your mask on anymore, Bruce. Not with me. Oh, are you gonna make me trot out all the evidence? All right. How about the vanishing? You pulled at the cafe when the bat signal showed up. You don't think I noticed how obvious that was? You think you can use that against me? As blackmail? Oh, I would never. We're two threads in the same stitch, remember? Bound together, even under strain. Then what's your point? After we raided the agency's convoy, Harley stashed one of their trucks here. And now it's gone, which means she's getting out of town, across the Gotham Bridge. Let me help you stop her. I'm not asking for much, just a little faith. I swear to you, this was self-defense. One more time, you do believe me, don't you? You still have faith in me, don't you? Your old buddy, John. This is a mess. 
and we are gonna need to talk about it more. But... I believe you. But you still have to turn yourself in. Excuse me? You'll get a chance to plead your case in court. You'd do that to me? Really? After all the things we've shared? We could have done great things together, Batman. But you had to go and ruin it! Hardly warned me about you. And now she needs my help. She was right. I belong at her side. Alfred, I lost John. Something tells me he'll be running right back to Harley. Anything I can do? Give me a surveillance feed at the Gotham Bridge. Harley's trying to get out of the city with the virus and a truck full of explosives. I'll need to suit up to stop her. GCPD needs to get these people far away. I see Harley's truck, Alfred. I could drop straight under the cab, take her out before she has a chance to detonate the C4. But there are a lot of civilians. No time to waste. Like if I'm shot or something, everything goes boom. You tell them I want the goddamn vials of Riddler's blood, or I, I'm gonna blow this freaking bridge to hell, and everyone on it. What's it gonna be, Bats? Doesn't seem like we got a lot of time. Look around you. You're not the one in control here. Then maybe we'll all go up in flames. I'm ready. <laughs> I see you found Miss Quinn. My people will take it from here. Stand aside, and we can all go on our merry way. This is a volatile situation, and you're not helping. You can't reason with a mind like hers. The only thing she understands is brute force. All of you can shut your damn pie holes. I want Riddler's blood right freaking now, or everyone here goes boom! Your threats are well and good, but I don't have it. Don't try and play me, lady. Your people took it from the subway. We took it, but someone destroyed it against my will. Someone on my team. It's gone. Whatever serum you thought you could make, it's off the table. It ain't true. It can't be. It is true. Disarm the detonator and put your hands behind your head. The hell I will! This is my show, and I'm the one calling the shots! <laughs> what the hell are you doing here? I came for you, Harley. 
I need you. Like a joke needs a punchline. Like maggots eat meat. What are you doing? They'll kill us. <laughs> oh, oh no, Harley. I'm going to kill them. Believe me, it's gonna be a blast. Stay where you are! <laughs> Give me the detonator. Now! You say you're all about justice. Justice is a joke! You tell me what's just about my life. I lost half of it in an asylum to a sickness I couldn't control. But now, I'm in control. Everybody, pull back! Ha, 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 ha!